Now, let's perform a setup of this Apple Watch Ultra. The app is ready, or the lock is ready. We have to get now a smartphone near me. If this happens, you will see on the screen of the smartphone that now the devices are in pairing mode. We use our iPhone to set up this Apple Watch here. Okay, let's continue now. Now we set up the Apple Watch. That's awesome. We can set up for ourselves, but also we can set up as for a family member. The family member does not need an iPhone after we set that up this process. That's a good idea for family members without an iPhone. But now we set it up for ourselves. Now the next step is we have to hold and we have to scan this screen to pair it each other. That means the information will be transferred each other, and then it is um, it is an it is an, 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 an status to pair them together. Let's perform this. We go and make a photo of it here. So now our Apple Watch is paired, as you can see. It's really easy, but it costs you, I think, five seconds. If your, 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 your um, focus is there from the photo app, then it will pierce it. So we make this to our new Apple Watch. We can customize the settings or continue from our data before. If we have another, um, another Apple Watch, then we can use the same settings. We, are my, we make now customizing settings, okay? We can restore this from a backup. We choose a backup from the below here, and then it's, it's like the other watch before. But if you do not, maybe this is your first watch, okay? So we have to set up as a new Apple Watch. Now, here comes it, wrist preferences. On which wrist do we wear the Apple Watch? On the left side or on the right side? We can choose. We choose the left side, okay? I think the left side is for me the, the better side. Then we turn some conditions, read them and agree them, okay? Because if you disagree, mm, nothing happens again. Now, we are signing in to our account. This may take a few minutes. That means now the Apple Watch Ultra is calling home an Apple server that she's here. That's the problem now. And if your Wi-Fi connection or it's not so fast, or your internet connection too, this will take a few minutes, okay? But if you're fast enough, this only gets you in 30 seconds or something. This is the say hello thing of your Apple Watch Ultra the first time. Now, we perform the next steps after we finish this step. Now we have to mm, set a passcode. The Apple Watch locks when we take it off and we cross the passcode to unlock. This helps protect our data, okay? So we create a passcode and the passcode we have to create on the Apple Watch. So create one, not like me here, then enter it again. And then it is. Now we have a passcode. The next step is the bold and tag size. We can choose it as we want. Bold text or not. Big or small. Like you like it. You can choose it. So here we are. Okay, that's good. If we choose the right board and tag site, we can continue. Now the information counts optimized charge limit. 
If we see an open charge ring, the Apple Watch will charge to an optimized limit. This limit adopts to our daily usage and prefers the battery lifespan over time. We can manage these battery settings on our Apple Watch. And then shared settings. Apple Watch shares settings with the phone for local services. Find my phone, Siri and analytics and improvement. Some watch faces and apps may use this location when location service is on. The fitness and the health app will be downloaded to our phone iPhone. The Apple Watch automatically works with the share of my location when we leave our phone behind. And now we have to personalize our fitness and health. That's um, a main feature, a bottom feature, to get there the date of birth, the sex, the height, and the weight. And of course, the wheelchair option. If you adjust this and enter this, we can make done and can continue. We get notifications about our health. For example, noise. Our Apple Watch microphone can measure sound levels without recording audio and notify us if the might affect our hearing. I think this is a good thing to prevent my ears. And now the safety informations. The Apple Watch can help in emergency. Because we have an emergency SOS, there's a whole side button to call the emergency services and notify, notify the emergency contacts or drop detection. The Apple Watch can call emergency services if detects a hard fall and uh, we will need help. And a crash detection. If an Apple Watch detects a car crash, it can call the emergency service for us too. And of course, we have alert a sirene if we need to attract help in an emergency case. Our watch can play a loud sound. And backtrack. In a remote setting, the Apple Watch can record our route in case of we get lost. That's a good safety main features of this Apple Watch Ultra. I like them all. But I... I hope I will need them all. So Apple Pay. We can add credit debit or store cards to the Apple Pay to make secure payment in apps, on the web and in the shops using any of the communication. We can set up now our credit card, for example, or we set up this later or never, as you like. Now the action button. We choose what we do like the action button to do. The action button is here located on the left side. It's an orange button and it can start a workout. It can start a stopwatch or it makes a waypoint, a backtrack, a dive or a torch. Let's try torch for example. Continue. Now Deft. The Deft app can automatically open underwater and measure temperature, time and depth. That's awesome. If you does not like this, you can do that manually, of course. You can choose don't open automatically. And of course, diving safety information. Underwater activities and risky. Before driving, read instruction, blah, blah, blah. To reduce risk of serious or fatal injuries when scuba diving, always use a backup device and follow diving safety protocols, of course. Next step. Here, we have an always on display. We see what's on our Apple Watch even when we are wrists down. Sensitive content may not be visible by default, but we can choose what's displays in the settings. And app view. We can choose, we have the grid view, it's, it's like a big cloud, or the list view. As we like, we can choose it. So, the Apple Watch is now syncing. Our Apple Watch is almost ready. We will get an alert when it's done, so we can use our iPhone as normally. While we're waiting, we can go to learn more about this watch. And here you can see some discovery getting starting information from Apple itself. What's new in the app? Welcome to the Apple Watch, Apple Watch user guide. Of course, customize our watch, health and fitness, export a watch, et, 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 et. And after this, we have to wait a little bit. But you can see it's really fast with syncing. It costs you not a lot of time. 
So we are near ready, as you can see, because we a device added to our account, as you can see, an Apple Watch now has access to iMessage and FaceTime. If we like to do to have this, we can say OK or we can go to settings. So now we are here. There it is. We make automatic me switch off and then we switch to our uh, watch ultra. OK, the next step. Here we are done. We can see here the watch is already on. We have to enter the passcode, of course, and then we are in it and we can use it. Really awesome. Let's go first and have a look here because now we are near, we are ready. We can use it now. But here's more. We can adjust it a little bit. We can choose notifications, app view, like we can sort them, for example. We can make an, a an grid view that's um, like before. Uh, we can choose what we like, okay? We can adjust, we can perform this here. And more, of course. We can look what the doc is looking, favorites or recents. We can make action button. You know, the torch thing. Here, torch, I pushed and the torch is coming after I entered the passcode, of course. Because the passcode I have only enter because it's not on my wrist okay so here torch is on torch is off nice isn't it and other options available too then we can here choose general mobile data because it's a gps version um, mobile data display and brightness accessibility series sounds and haptics passcode you can choose and um, change Emergency SOS options, privacy activities, da, 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 and each app you can uh, make an um, adjustment about this. Then we can go to face gallery. Here we can look what faces we are looking for or what faces we like and we can choose them as we like. For example, we make here activity. Let's perform this and we can adjust it too. the colors we can change. OK, and of course, we can make the um, complications, AQI, walkie talkie, voice memos, timer functions. So many options are available. Choose what you like. OK, we can perform this top left, top right or on the bottom side. And on other faces, it's may maybe there are more possibilities to add um, these complications. So. And then, of course, you have to add them. Now it is on the app. So enter the passcode and here we are. It should be added there. Why it's not added now? Hmm. Ah, here we are. <laughs> OK, so this is face gallery. And of course, we can choose discovery again to look there. OK, let's go to the uh, to the watch. Here is the watch. On the watch side, we have the action button. This is, as you can see, um, for for what you like to enter there. I choose the torch light now. Torch is on and torch is off. But there are other possibilities, too. If you push and hold this orange button a long time, as you can see, it will go to the emergency setup. You can choose a serene, medical ID, or a compass backtrack, and an emergency call. To choose them, slide it. Or you hold this for a long time, and the serene will automatically go on. Boy, this is loud. Woo! Okay. Wow, that's really loud. OK, this is this area. This is the action button. OK, so what's next? On the right side, we have another button. Let's push them. And you can see now these are um, the still running apps in the background. You can close them, but you will not delete them like this. OK, you can close them, swipe and push. And if you um, double tap, we can use Apple Pay. And if we hold this button, we go to the 
Sirene, Medical ID, Compact, Bad Rent is the same, okay? You can hold it. And an emergency call will come after five seconds. Of course, you can switch off your um, Apple Watch too. So the digital crone over here is to rotating and to pushing. For rotating, you can see you can go between list up and down and you can zoom in and zoom out. And push, go back to the home screen or go back to your face. Okay, to choose the uh, face you like, you can swipe here. And here on the main face, there is an extra thing. If you rotate the crone, you will go to the red mode. This is good in darkness. Okay, what's next? If we are pushing here and we are now in the cloud, we can choose the different staff of apps. There's a lot of apps available on the market. For example, we can choose and uh, go to the diving app. We can make a alert, calculator, heartbeat, uh, or here, here it is, noise app and so many more. Okay, let's perform a little bit. We can choose, for example, we can choose the ECG app. The ECG is a really awesome thing because this is part of your health data and this can help you to detect um, failures of your heartbeat. The Apple Watch never checks for heart attacks, of course, but it will help you to see what's going on with your heart. I like it really much. This is an awesome option here. And I hope I'm well. Sinus rhythm. The ACG does not show a thing of an arterial fibrillation. That's good. Okay, let's go down. This is a good app. Here's another good app. The heart rate. The heart rate can rate your heart rate, as you can see. And you can see here, walking average, high intense interval training average, post workout average, high intensive interval training, da, 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 so many informations. You can see them. And current is 77 bits per minute. And there is more, more awesome thing. Here, blood oxygen. Let's have a look that our blood oxygen will be good. Or maybe it's not good. So let's start it now. This costs you 15 seconds, and this is a good thing for your oxygen status. Hmm. So, what oxygen status we have right now? Here we are. Oh, that looks great. 99 perth and blood. Oh, yeah. And of course, there's more available. So many awesome things. Reflect or breathe. For reflect, you will see an awesome color on the screen. And now, it, come on, man. Take a moment to pause. Ah, calm down and begin relaxing now. That's awesome. Or it looks so beautiful, so nice. You can see this good screen. Eh? Really awesome. And so many more apps. Messenger, for example. Mail services. Uh, compass here. Here you can see. Here. Yeah. Allow the company, of course. Allow while using the app. Okay. So now you can use the compass. Really cool. Walkie talkie, podcast, uh, smart home. Everything is possible to choose and to use. Of course, you can go to set. There is a possibility of settings. You can control notifications, general focus, the airplane mode, mobile data, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, display and brightness level, app view, dark action button, accessibilities. It's like the same on the phone, but only on our Apple Watch, as you can see. And then, of course, you can swipe up, down, upwards, down, and here you can see notifications. You can go from the bottom up and you can see the load status and different kind of options are available. This you can edit easily here with that button over there. And then you can relieve or let, let this or remove it or add it. And if you perform this, you can make done. So you can see it's a nice and easy job. 
Of course, you can go to your activity rings. Here, there's some information about our activities. And, of course, our awards. All what you can see on your iPhone is here too. Because this is a small iPhone. So awesome. I like this really much. And, of course, you can make um, a workout. Start a workout here. And a lot of workouts are available. Outdoor walk, indoor walk, la 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 la. So many things you can do and perform with this app. And then if you start one of them, you can you will see so many information about the workout status. What you're going to do is the time, the active kilocalories, the total kilocalories, the bits per minute of your heart, and of course here are those. In that zones, you can see how much power you will need on your workout now. And here, lock, and and pause. And of course, you can um, choose your um, favorite music. So that's awesome. Really awesome watch because she, it is beautiful. It is so intuitive to perform. And so many awesome options are available with that watch. This is... The Apple Watch Ultra. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Soon, soon.